guys, what's up? My name is Caitlin. This is Bree. She is my very special guest today. I'm so excited. <laughs> oh, and so. today we're going to talk about art. Like we we've made art today. Yeah, we did. Beautiful magic. And we are going to oh, share it. Yeah. So, <laughs> we are Behold. artists. Yeah. Behold. <laughs> okay. We learned that word today. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so we made this. What else did you make, Caitlin? Oh, and Shop. we painted rocks. Really ah. really <laughs> um, anyways, we made art today because we wanted to play around with our creativity. So, we were talking about um, letting yourself play and how art is the expression of the soul. And it's art because you made it. And nobody can do what you can do. And as long as you're expressing whatever you are feeling, like and you channel that into something that didn't exist before. Like literally these things did not exist yesterday. They, or even like three hours ago. Yeah, <laughs> they just, you know, they just manifested. And they're completely different because we're completely different. So yeah. it's like I make certain things and she makes certain things and we can't make each other's art because we're not each other, we're ourselves. <laughs> exactly, and that's what, it, that's so special. And you know, the other day when I was showing Caitlin, um, all these birds. Can I just talk about yeah, the yeah. birds? Talk about birds. <laughs> <laughs> I just love birds, dude. Okay. So, but it matters because it's like, you know, all these birds from Costa Rica. <laughs> They're so beautiful. And I literally was just scrolling on Instagram and looking at all these birds and how each of them has different colors. They have different shapes. And they're so beautiful and unique in their way. And then Caitlin was like, oh, well, aren't humans also so very special and unique and different and that's what makes them beautiful because like we're all so different and our differences is what makes us beautiful um and i think we're going on a tangent that's okay but yeah. we can talk about beautiful birds and beautiful people <laughs> and everyone is beautiful in their own way like everyone is their own artist and everyone can make their own art and it's not gonna look like anyone else's exactly and who knows? and just allow yourself to play basically because you know, there was this moment where it's like, oh, I want to make this. It doesn't look like how my brain wants it to look. But, like, your soul, just, like, get out of your soul's way and let it express. Like, it doesn't have to be perfect. Like, there's also, there's this, like, um thought that I read somewhere or, you know, I don't know. Anyway, where it's just, like, perfectionism is undercover fear and insecurity. So we use perfectionism to be like, oh yeah, I'm a perfectionist. And it's like, no, bitch, you're, you're scared. You're scared to like see what happens if you get out of your own way. And you're just scared to be this bright ass beautiful being that you are. And you're using perfectionism as an excuse to not create these beautiful things. So, yeah. And art is literally everywhere. I mean, the clothes that you're, you're wearing, someone made it someone's an artist yeah. you know and paintings and poems and books and nails and nails <laughs> like, yeah that's someone's art <laughs> yeah exactly and it's like sometimes we don't see it because we're trying to be perfect right but like somebody who can't do it like my friend Brie can I just yeah yeah um, <laughs> so she makes these beautiful nails and it's like it's her art like she made it and I can't make it like neither and, and yeah like we can't make it and but she can, but she's feeling these, um, like, fears about, like, oh, I'm not ready. But, you know, maybe because you're comparing yourself to someone who's, um, has, has had more practice and experience and has been doing it for a longer time. But it's like, you know, but there's these people that have not done the work that you've done who see this as, like, well, shit, like, I can't do this, you know? Yeah. Yeah. And even, like, dancing is art and decorating cakes is art. Mm -hmm. And yeah, cooking, baking, maybe I'm just hungry. <laughs> no, we haven't had, we haven't ate. <laughs> um, we had snacks though. <laughs> yeah. Like even this random collage behind me, like Behold. I put it together. It's art. <laughs> Behold. Yeah. I love that word, dude. Yeah. <laughs> we learned that, I learned that word today. Um, <laughs> it's beautiful. It's just, you know, and beauty is in the eye of the beholder. Like beholding, what was the definition? It meant according to wikipedia yeah okay. <laughs> behold means to see or observe a thing or person especially a remarkable or impressive one so it is like um and i just wanted to share this remember like i had talked to you about how 
I met someone who told me who's like a psychologist or is a master in psychology. And when you see something beautiful, you there's these um, brain chemicals that are released that make you feel happy and like, like, oh, that's so cute, you know, like, so whenever you see something beautiful, those chemicals get released in your brain. But also when you see something ugly, the same chemical reaction is created in your brain. So literally, like, you give it meaning. So something that can be beautiful to someone can be, like, somebody can perceive it as ugly, and it's the same chemical reaction. So literally, what you perceive is all depending on what people give the meaning to it. it. So literally, like, you know, something, somebody can see this and be like, oh my god, it's the prettiest thing. Like, I believe this is the prettiest thing I've seen. And... <laughs> <laughs> and but someone can be like oh that's not art like it's not like picasso but like this is picasso better than, i mean you know picasso it's it, he's like good in his own way you know like there's nobody better than anybody like it's all how people perceive it and how how you want to interpret it well it's making me think of like the dollar bill or no hundred dollar bill analogy yeah. where it's like oh a hundred dollar bill like that that's valuable even if someone steps on it and crinkles it up, like, it's still a hundred dollar bill. Exactly. Um, and it's still worth something. And just because someone else doesn't see its worth, doesn't mean it loses its value. Exactly. So, yeah. like, your art is worthy. Yeah, your art is worthy <laughs> too. I love it. And it's, like, it, it's special because you made it. You know? <laughs> <I'm just> like, <laughs> because, like, nobody is you. Like, they're, you're, like, literally a one of one edition. Like and and so is everyone actually. Yeah, so we're, we all are yeah. a one of one. Like we're all limited edition, and like we need to stop comparing ourselves and just like you know and just let your soul live and be and play. Go and make the art you want to make. Go make the YouTube videos you want to make. Go start the Instagram you want to make. Yeah. Go sing songs you want to sing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do all the things you want to do, and you know we were talking about yesterday, right? Like how. Or I don't know if I was talking to you, but okay. <laughs> I thought I was talking somewhere. But how like we only have one life. Like we could literally die in like, I don't know, as we walk outside. Like life is so fragile. Like there's these people who just die every second. And we don't know when our like we act and pretend like we're out here taking life for granted. And it's like you're really not going to experiment and have fun. When it's like you could die tomorrow, like that makes no sense. But like I see it. It's like, oh, I'll start chasing my dreams tomorrow when the weather's right, when it's perfect, when I'm ready, blah, blah, blah. Like, you know, eventually. But it's like, yeah, but eventually isn't promised. Exactly. So might as well do, like all we have is now, right now, today. Like the past doesn't exist. It's all an illusion in your head. But if you're, and the future doesn't exist either. You know, so we're, we all have just this moment right here, right now. And in my office. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And yeah, it's, it's so valuable, but it, it's hard to see, you know, because when you're, when you're chasing things and you want things, you're, you're wanting things to be a certain way and you're not accepting things as they, they are, you're stuck either in the future or in the past and you can't appreciate and make changes right now that are going to compound into a better future so the only thing you can control is what you do today you know and and it's easy to see how we can all get caught up into like oh yeah i'm not gonna make that until i have this until i have that until i have the experience the knowledge the education the certificate the validation of a fucking paper like yeah and I, i've been guilty of that too you know like it's we're all human and but once you realize like okay we only have today yeah and if you never start those people that you look up to like you're never going to get that good if you don't start today yeah. like this is like my sixth youtube video and it ain't gonna be perfect <laughs> yeah but it's you know you're not like we were talking about how like mileage you know like this concept of like mileage like when you start comparing yourself to someone who has like higher mileage or experience who has been like doing this for 20 years like it's not gonna look the same because you don't have those 20 years of experience you don't have the mileage that they have ran mm -hmm. and you're not gonna get the mileage until you actually start driving your car and start like doing it and you know and look at you you have six miles now 
yay <laughs> you know <laughs> and you're just gonna keep on adding on to that and you're gonna be getting better as you go and like a year from now you're gonna have 365 miles like hey. if you you know if you yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you did like a video every day but but you know what i mean Goals. yeah <laughs> like yeah it's hard <laughs> but you know what i mean like it's yeah. it's yeah like, and it's like when you don't give up that compounds over time like that the small little changes add up like the small actions the small art the small things like they're gonna become big yeah you just can't give up yeah and just start wherever you're at however which whatever knowledge you have with what you have just do the best you can with what you have right now and and yeah and just have fun yeah like life is not that serious we're gonna die anyway like might as well. Like, <laughs> right? Yeah. Thank you so much for watching. I um, how can people find you? Um, so I'm on Instagram as Rainbow Bunny Co. Um, I do also have a YouTube video. You can find all my links and stuff on my Instagram. There's a link in the bio, and yeah, just and I'll link her stuff down below um, in the description as well. You're so cute. She's my best friend. <laughs> okay. Well, thank you for watching. I hope everyone has an amazing day. Yeah. Bye. Bye.